All right, man. Uh, here with a uh, bro job. Just want to say, starting out, you guys are amazing. Uh, love, love your guys' work. Um, super stoked to hear you guys. Uh, how'd this tour come about? How'd you guys, uh, you know, hop on with Goon Lord? Have you guys been fans of them before? Um, how, how did that all work out? Uh, we have a tour manager sure that thankfully does all okay. that work for us. <laughs> <laughs> shout, shout out to Tyler. Yeah. Tyler rules. Yeah. Yeah, Fuck Tyler. yeah. Um, I, I think we booked and then we had to make a run up there. Yeah, yeah exactly. So it would make sense to go up We there, hit up so. Goon Lord. We played with them in the past. We played with them yeah. in Orlando. Yeah. Um, so I know, like I said a minute ago, you guys do a bunch of covers and a lot of features and stuff as well. Um, is that something whenever you started the band, you kind of wanted to focus on? Is kind of like, you know, dipping into a bunch of other musicians and bringing them on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. For, for sure. Hell yeah. Um, is it is it like weird that you know like some people consider you know you guys as like a like a funny band, kind of like Party Cannon or something like that? You know, like. I expected that. Yeah. Yeah. Which is a good thing. It's a positive yeah. thing too. Yeah. And I mean, you guys still bring up, you know, we're watching a bunch of live videos. You bring hella good energy and yeah, yeah. the shows are good as hell, you know. And and uh, like I was saying earlier as well, you guys have been blowing up over 100,000 listeners on uh, Spotify now. Mm -hmm. um, what's some influences that you guys, uh, uh, you kind of, you know, whenever, you, whenever, you, whenever you're in the studio or whatever, making music or, or about to come out with something, what's some, what's some bands you listen to that kind of inspire you a little bit? Uh. I don't know, music is, it's kind of wild actually. Um, yeah. <laughs> let's see, what's, what's some good shit? Uh, Do Move or Year is a big one. Right okay. Uh, I love Insomnium. Also. Okay. Mashuga is like probably the biggest influence yeah. by far. Uh, if we haven't ripped them off yet, like it, it will probably happen. <laughs> um, uh, lately I've been like really big into like Slaughter's Prevail. Yeah. Like, for sure. I try to like ingest as much influence as I can, but I always fall back to like Michelle Good. Yeah. Like, Nothing wrong with that, man. Yeah, it's yeah, it's, it's, it's a good pick right there. Um, how'd you guys form, if you don't mind me asking? How'd you guys meet uh, <laughs> and come, come up with the name, all that? Like. So, <laughs> I started this shit as a joke. Yeah. Um, <laughs> actually, we, we've been using the word bro job and talking about like starting a band like yeah. years ago. And I finally just like one night I was like, dude, I don't give a fuck. I'm just gonna do this overnight. Yeah. I designed a logo, wrote the first song, animated a lyric video, video in like an hour and a half. Dude, All that's... made in an hour and a half. And I threw it on Facebook, made a Facebook page, threw fifty dollars down as like a fucking ad revenue, and it blew up overnight. And because of that, because of fifty bucks and me being bored. We're here right now playing a fucking tour, like yeah. Dude. all the inside yeah. jokes and shit. Yeah, you just, know, you know, it's like that whole like fucking the, the toxic group. masculinity we bullshit. Would always, yeah. we would always say that, like, like, dude, bro job would have to be the heaviest yeah, fucking like, band. Like, what's more <laughs> badass than like beating someone up is kissing them? Yeah, a hundred percent, man. <laughs> Um, we don't throw fists, we throw fists. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> it's a motto right there, dude. <laughs> um, so uh, what's some uh, what's some bands you guys would like to tour with? You, I mean, you have any like homie bands that you want to shout out? That um, you? I really want to tour Crystal Lake. Okay. Our our, our buddy John is uh, their new vocalist actually. Yeah. Fuck shout yeah. Shout out to you, buddy, if you're watching this. Um, our, our, our buddies and left to suffer. Oh, dude, they come. Dude, they're so good. Yeah, they're so nice. We went on tour with Falsifier last May, and they're fucking homies right there. We are actually going to be hanging out with them. We're having like a little sleepover weekend with them soon. With a mixer with some metal dudes down in Florida. Oh, yeah. Tampa area. Tactosis. Tactosis. Yeah, 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 Tactosis. Yeah,
he's so innovative. Like, I don't understand. Like, he will sit in his room for hours and just come up with these crazy. Yeah. Weird well, I add in like clips of the show too, and the interviews and stuff. Like, so I'll add in something like, too. Like, yeah. you the predator look? Oh my god. Yeah, like That's giant. brutal. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Dude, he does some like really wild shit. Yeah. Bodies. That's sick, dude. Hell he yeah. Fucking coming down yeah and he is doing a lightsaber. He literally got noticed two days before we were supposed to leave our tour. So he got on a plane from fucking California. Well, you're the MVP of the tour, dude. It sounds flew like literally. In, <laughs> flew in yesterday. Fuck yeah. And dude, it's just he, he really saved. So I mean, are you are you excited? I know you know. Yeah. 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 I'm yeah. Happy his nervousness is dying down. I think. Yeah. It's dying down. yeah. yeah. And there's dudes, you know, especially being your first show, you know, you're gonna be nervous and stuff, dude. But once you get out there, bro, it's. Yeah, I'm sure you're gonna kill. It. Yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah. What's some uh, like things you want to do this the rest of the year? Are you planning any more tour dates? Working on music? I mean, what's some things you guys kind of want to do? I we have uh, an EP that actually gonna surprise a lot of people it's, I can't talk about like dude, a lot of bands might either be butthurt about <laughs> this idea or they're gonna love it so we'll see what happens okay uh our Christmas EP popped off pretty hard last year so yeah dude that was fire gonna, I'm definitely gonna do a continuation of that and add more songs to that yeah uh we have we have some uh we have tours. Yeah, we have a lot of tours. This year, there's there's some short runs, but we're going. We're trying to get around a lot. So okay. I think we're trying to eventually leave the U.S. too. So yeah, I don't want to. 2024, wanna, we're going to we'll, try to get out of the U.S. If if we can, I don't want to say yes for sure. Gonna try. Yeah, we'll we'll, we'll try. Um. Uh, I know, like like I said earlier, you guys do a bunch of covers and cool stuff like that. Have any uh, like bands or artists hit you guys up or found out about them? You know, and, and, and shouted you guys out or kind of. Yeah. Um, I don't know if any of the original artists have hit us up. Yeah. If they have listened to it, I'm sure they were like, what the fuck? Is yeah. This? Um, but yeah, we just did one recently. Um, I cannot pronounce his name. The, the guy who just won Eurovision from Finland. Okay. I cannot pronounce his name. I talked to him. Yeah, he does the cha 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 song. Okay. We had to get that cover done in one day's time. So uh, that was interesting, learning a different language. Yeah, so, that must have been rough. <laughs> Finnish is ridiculously fucking hard. Yeah. To scream it also is way harder. I couldn't imagine doing yeah, something Jacob, like that. Jacob was saying that too, man. Dude, he said the same thing. It, Shout out to Jacob. Yeah, it was a challenge, but that was it turned out really cool. It sounds like Rammstein with like fucking... I don't know. Yeah. Man. Like, <laughs> like an attack attack chorus. Or something. I don't know. Cool. It's fucking wild, dude. <laughs> um... So yeah, man. I mean, end it off. Any 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 bands you think are underrated uh, that you think uh, get slept on? Memories. Okay. Right now. Go check those guys out. Shout out to Bob. Any, homie. Anybody else think any bands are underrated that you want to shout out? Okay. I'll have to check them out. I haven't heard of them either. Yeah. Yeah. Go check out our our band End of an Arrow. Okay. We're dropping a new song June 16th, I think. I think it's the 15th. Yeah. So the 15th, yeah. So June 15th, we have a new song dropping. And it's a music video, too. So if you like Paxson's growls, this song Check it is going to make you shit your balls. Fuck yeah. Well. <laughs> also, Goon Lord. Yeah. Goon Lord, yeah, yeah man. Super stoked to see those guys tonight as well. Yeah, really excited to be on tour. So yeah, last question. Um, how's the tour been so far? I know you, you've only had what, like, is this the first day? You've had one? Okay, first night. I can summarize uh, this tour so far. Yeah, it's been good. <laughs> six hours, we, one of the rest stops so far has been pretty nice. Yeah. And some of us pissed. I threw away some trash out of the van. Yeah. Uh, I talked about <laughs> pissing while we were pissing. Yeah. And oh, there was yeah. another guy that was out of our group, and he was like talking to us too, and that was kind of. You can tell oh, fuck yeah. While he was pissing? Yeah, yeah we were yeah, okay. Yeah, we pissing while pissing. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. Was, there was four of us pissing at the same time and it like it reminded me of like you ever put those like uh those youtube videos of like calming rain sounds yeah yeah i listen like all the that, time but it was four dudes pissing into a urinal dude i was like dude i could probably sleep through this yeah you should have taken advantage of that man and put a little well, audio I in mentioned there that and this guy was like hell yeah like, you know, that wasn't our group. So, uh, that, that's awesome yeah. yeah and then we ate some gas station food as you do on tour and, yeah well, this venue is great so far. Though. Yeah, this is yeah. really sick. Yeah. yeah, we're stoked. 
Well, it's usually, I mean, you guys should be getting like a free pizza and stuff like that. Oh, usually, yeah, really yeah, it up. Yeah, okay, oh yeah, oh yeah. It's actually really good too. Yeah, yeah. A lot of people when they think of venue food, dude, they don't really think of like good food most of the time. I but was very that was nice. I'm a, I'm a yeah. pretty big critic when Fuck it comes to pizza, and that was pretty funny. Yeah, my buddy Ian owns it here, and dude, and he does a pretty good job. He always, you know, shows love to the bands, you know, and he he runs a pretty cool ship here. So, but yeah, he'll appreciate that a lot. But, um, yeah, man, I appreciate you guys chatting with me. Uh, check them out on everything, dude, and go listen to them. They play sick ass shit like Barbie Girl. They cover like Suicide Boys, fucking, you know, whatever you listen to, bro, they probably covered it, honestly. And they also got a bunch of sick ass OG stuff, too, dude. So go check that out. Uh, they're super consistent, drop music all the time. Support them, man. Go check them out on tour, buy some merch. Uh, and yeah, man, thank you guys so much for chatting with me. You guys were awesome. And yeah. Good luck on your first show, bro. I'm super stuck listening to you. <laughs> there we go, man. Thank you guys so much, bro.